today, today I'm going to do a review on Cedar White. So I got her at Justice. She was on sale. She was on sale. So that was pretty good. And, um, yeah. She's mostly found at Justice. So if you are looking for her, I suggest you go and look at Justice. Let me start with, okay, so let's get on to the review. Let me start with her accessories. She comes with a bookmark, of course, and her charm is a cricket, and she's also an Everaster High Rebel. And like every other storybook, this is her story, or her her diary, whatever whatever you want to call it. Um, she comes with a stand and a brush. And she comes with this purse, which is super detailed, but I'll just show it to you. So, the, and the purse can't open and close, but it has a rubber band around it, so I prefer to leave it there. Alrighty, so let's get on to the box up here. It says, honest to goodness. Wait, honest to uh, uh, Yeah, honest to goodness. And there's her in her Pinocchio form. And up here is a easel with some paint. And then like every other box, it says Cedar Wood. Then alongside here, it says Cedar Wood, daughter of Pinocchio. And I'll be reading to you what it says on the back of the box. Okay, so up the top, it always has the, are you a royal or a rebel? It says, Cedar Wood, created from the same magic wood that brought her father to life. Cedar, Cedar is creative, diminutive, and always honest. Unfortunately, she's literally, literally, always honest as her father accidentally wished for an unbreakable curse that made her tell the truth no matter what but cedar is one person person puppet who never gives up on her personal journey to become a real girl now i will read to you two facts about her um let's see one what is your secret heart's desire? And she put, Yeah, I want to be a real girl, but mostly I just want to choose what I want or don't want to say. And the second fact is, what is what magic touch makes you special? She put, I'm a excellent swimmer because I because I always float. Hey, being made of magic wood has its advantages. Alrighty. So here's. And um, up here it shows you that it comes with a bookmark. That's her story. And this little keyhole. And in here. And, and down here it has Blondie Locks, Cerise Hood, and Cupid. So that's for what she came with. Now let me get on to the doll. So, let me start off by saying, her hair is really curly, which is pretty good, because it looks cute like that. So she has this little braid up here that goes all around, and it's got some purple in it. And she has this little barrette that's a cricket. Her makeup is brown with a dark a dark red lipstick that is the same as Cupid's. And her earrings are a little tree stump. So I'm gonna give you a close up of that. And she comes with a little ring 
that looks like a butterfly and a bracelet that has leaves and crickets and butterflies on it. So that's her ring and her bracelet. Her outfit is a, let's see, I'll just show it to you because it has so much detail in it, which I'm pretty happy about. And it's the same for the dress part of it. It's the same material as Blondie Locks. And then she's got some knee high. Well, I don't know if you would say knee high sneakers, but they're not knee high sneakers. Knee high socks. Or I don't know what you would call them. But they're golden. And have these little ribbons along the side. Her shoes are super detailed. Um, so I'll try my best to review them. I love, let me just say one thing. I love seeing her. She's so pretty. I mean, I hope y'all get her. I mean, I hope y'all get her on sale. I hope everyone had a chance to get her. We wanted her. Okay, let's move on to the shoes. So as you can see, they're brown with a pinkish pink for the strap. The same as her dress up here. So, um... Yeah, that's my review on Cedar Wood. Please comment, subscribe, and this is Lucy Bell signing up. Also, I forgot one thing. I hope everyone has a chance to get her on sale. She's about 20 bucks when you go to your local justice. So you should get her about what you would pay something like at Walmart or something. So I hope everyone could get her while she's out there and at justice. So um, this is Lucy Bell signing off. Bye.